need to come with me right now. We're going outside. Yeah, I'm well aware of how late it is, but that doesn't matter right now. It's going to be worth it, I, I promise. It's uh, a surprise. Please just trust me on this one. I know me taking out into the forest in the middle of the night doesn't sound like a very good idea. But if I don't head out now, there may not be another chance before you're heading home again. Yeah? You're in? Awesome. Get well dressed then. It's pretty cold outside. I don't know how long we'll be. Uh, that depends on how long you'll feel like staying. Oh, no worries. I have some extra woolen clothes you can borrow. They should keep you warm enough. Oh yeah, they'll fit. They're from back when I was way younger and <laughs> smaller. I'm glad I've kept them until now. Let's see. Now where did I put them? Oh, here. These should fit you well enough. Put these on. I'll just be, uh, I'll just be waiting for you outside. Hey, there you are. And you're all dressed up. How do the clothes fit you? Great. Let's get going then. Hmm? Oh, um, there, uh, there is, a uh, there is a spot, I know. It's, it's not that far. It's just up this hill. It shouldn't really take as long to get up there. Nope. I'm still not telling you. You got to wait until we reach the top. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm impossible. I guess I'm never gonna get you with me on any of those mountain hikes that I've been talking about then, am I? Ah. <laughs> uh. It's nice to take a stroll late at night like this, though. It's always very calming for me. Hmm? You find it scary? I mean, I don't blame you, though. I mean, we're, we're walking through a dark forest in the middle of the night, after all. But I promise you, we are 100% safe. There's nothing scary going on here. <laughs> Don't worry. I wouldn't let anything happen to you. Still, though, maybe I should have brought the flashlights with us. No, oh, no. We're not going back for them now. <laughs> worst comes to worst, we could always use our phones. Or at least your phone. I don't think using mine is a very good idea. It always just shuts down in cold temperatures like this. Yeah, you're right. I should definitely buy a new one. Oh, come on. I'm only using an old phone because I'm a responsible human being who knows how to take care of my stuff. I am not greedy. <sighs> well, okay, yeah. Now that you mention it, maybe I'm a little bit greedy. So, um, did you enjoy your, your stay here so far? Good. I'm really glad to hear that. I was actually really nervous that you weren't going to like it here. I don't know. I think it's just me overthinking like usual. Just a normal what-if thinking. Ugh. I can't believe we only got one more day left before you're leaving, though. Time really flies when we're having fun. Oh, we're, uh, we're here. Hmm? <laughs> yeah, I... I guess I am shivering a little bit. No, I'm I'm not cold. I I don't know. But 
look look here though this is what I wanted to show you yeah it's beautiful isn't it ever since we started talking about meeting up I've been thinking about showing you this place you always said that you wanted to see the northern lights and since you're leaving home soon I thought it would be nice to let you see it at least one time now when the skies are clear and we have the opportunity yeah <laughs> i really wanted to surprise you <laughs> the view though the lights combined with the view of the city at night it's it's absolutely breathtaking almost as almost as breathtaking as you I I honestly don't know if if I have any courage left to say it again I I said that it almost look as breathtaking as you yes I do like you in that way honestly how could I not you're literally one of the nicest kindest most caring people I know every time I've been sad upset or angry you've been there for me every time I've achieved something you've been there supporting me cheering me on and celebrated with me and you constantly make me laugh you're easy to be comfortable around and you're also really smart no i will not shut up you're literally one of the few people i feel comfortable being myself around i never feel pressure to be someone i'm not when i'm with you not to mention that you're the prettiest person i've ever seen you have the pretty smile you overall just make me really happy so you know, taking all of that into consideration, it's not really that weird that I- I am going to guess that means do you feel the same way? I- I don't know what to say. I've been thinking about telling you for so long now, but I didn't really imagine that you'd actually feel that way too. I guess, I don't know. It's just a whole stereotypical situations with friends catching feelings for each other. One friend gets the feelings, the other doesn't feel the same way or don't want to risk the friendship and so on yeah I guess I just didn't want to set myself up for disappointment but yeah I just didn't want to not tell you and then sit and wonder what could have happened if I did So, how long have you been feeling this? That long? Were you just really good at hiding it? Or am I just that dense? <laughs> hmm. I don't know, really. I think it just started from... When we first started talking and then I just started liking you more and more over time. I don't really know exactly when it could be defined as romantic feelings, but it's been a while. Like, it just eventually came to the point where I was thinking about you all the time. You were the first person to 
strike my mind when I woke up and the last person I thought of before I went to sleep. Whenever I'd update my profile picture on social media, the only thing I could think about was if you were gonna like it or not. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? You're freezing? Well, maybe you should move in a bit closer again then. <laughs> So, we're really doing this? Are you... Are you sure? Good. I, um... I really wanted this too. Yeah, I think we should head back now. The last thing I want is for... One of us to get sick on the last day you have left here. <laughs> yeah, of course we can cuddle when we get back. I mean, I brought you out into this cold, so I guess it's only fair that I'll help warm you up again then. Come on, let's get going back. 